guys, welcome back to our channel. Before we get started, click that like button, turn on notifications, give all of you thumbs up. Good morning, friends. I hope you like my sunflowers, and I like the message. It says, life is a journey. Enjoy every moment. My name is Ina Irby, and I'm a mom. Courage to change. August 4th. I can certainly learn from criticism. And I want to remain open to hearing what others have to say. But neither my popularity nor my ability to please those I live and work with are legitimate measures of my worth as an individual. Al-Anon helps me to recognize that I have value simply because I breathe the breath of humanity. As I gain self-esteem, I find it easier to evaluate my behavior more realistically. The support I get in Al-Anon helps me find the courage to learn about myself. As I come to feel at home with myself and my values, my likes and dislikes, my dreams and choices. I am increasingly able to risk other people's disapproval. I am equally able to honor others when they choose to be themselves, whether or not I like what I see. Today's reminder, with the help of a loving sponsor and the support of my fellow Al-Anon members, I am learning to find my place in this world, a place where I can live with dignity and respect. The quote is from Walt Whitman. Quote, I exist as I am. That is enough. If no other in the world be aware, I sit content. And if each and all be aware, I sit content. End quote. I'll read that again. I exist as I am. That is enough. If no other in the world be aware, I sit content. And if each and all be aware, I sit content. Courage to change. Affirmations for the inner child. It's on time. I have all the time I need. Sometimes I feel as though I'll never have enough time to do all the things I need to do. Today, I will live in child time. When school threatened to drag on forever and summer promised to never end. In this time of long, full, wonderful days, I can begin to slow down and look closely at everything. I can lie in the grass and watch as a whole world opens to me. From this perspective, I see ants marching home, carrying grains of soil that seem the size of boulders, weeds that look like redwood trees, and spider webs that resemble fishing nets. When I tire of this view, I can roll over and look up in the sky watching the clouds slowly pass, changing shape from ship to castle to wisp. Today in child time, I will see things I have never noticed, even though they have always been there. I do have time. I hope this helps you on your healing journey, friends.